Bangani. Welcome to a new vlog. If you're new here, my name is Amanda Jingela and welcome to my YouTube channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so, so much for coming back and supporting my channel. Um, as you can see on my previous clip, I was at Anesthetic this morning for my toes as well as my cornrows which i'm very happy about um it's currently a thursday i have a friend's birthday lunch this afternoon so i'm basically doing all my prep this morning uh and i'm happy that i'm on time so the lady that's doing my makeup is Knox. i'm gonna try to give her a call um, and see what time can she slot me in because she's doing me a favor. I'm such a last minute person. She is doing me a favor. So I'm trying to give her a call to see if I can come through now or in the next hour. In the meantime, I should go and change or not. I'm not sure. I'll see though. I'll see what she says and then I'll see you guys at the Knox. I'm going to go but I'm not sure. I'm going to go to the Okay, we are going to go to the lab. I'm going to go to the lab. Yeah, it's going yeah. Okay, yeah. cool. Alright, I'm going to be there just now. We have arrived at my makeup appointment. Um. Like I mentioned, Knox is doing my face. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along. It's a busy day, it's a busy day. Uh, your skin looks amazing. It's looking so much better, hey? It looks amazing. Thank you. So much better, I got this in Hey, go on, give me a stress. Uh, I see all whether it's stress related, but all daughter what it's adult acne. What should doctor I'm gonna talk to Lou. Oh okay. Yeah. So she said I had adult acne. So you don't wanna say hi to my blog? No, but can I do my makeup? No, mm, so. okay, okay. <laughs> okay, it's fine. <laughs> Expensive girl, right here. Yeah. Birthday girl. We are at the pencil. Fully's birthday. Love it, chair. Yes, funny, I lean down. Yummy. That chick and child. Yeah. Amazing. That is me. <gasps> Thank you. It's the famous Mrs. Chicken. Oh, that is a you know huge what? cut. No, it looks beautiful. It's it a birthday amazing, meal, friend. right? That is a it's birthday meal. It looks amazing. It's a lot. Ooh. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted with the mesh. Yummy. Chef, I love, I love him. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad. Oh, this is exactly Thank what you I so much. Ooh. This is Let me just quickly get you the shell basket. I want to cry because this is exactly what I that's my final look. Um, Knox Zoni did my makeup and I love it. Uh, I did my own hair install, but let me show you guys my full outfit, friend. Let me cover up this side. Okay. Hey Bangani, welcome to a new day of this vlog. So I'm currently made up and dressed up in the car, actually at the venue because I am at Gateway to Eternity. 
my English to attend the, the Dior event. So I am literally on time. Okay, I'm five minutes late. So I will see you guys inside and yeah, and I'll show you the rest of my outfit and all the details once I'm settled. Guys, can I tell you something funny? I actually have diarrhea, like really bad diarrhea right now. But I'm gonna suck it in, literally. <laughs> I don't. I'm not a fan. So I have, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm not a fan. <laughs> really? I'm really not a fan. Like the rooster father. Okay, I'll put a fruit in the sky as well. Okay, I'll I'll try it. I'll try it. So I'm gonna spare food for you. Okay. So this is now. I think I'll sit there. This is now absolutely beautiful. Sorry. Some coffee here. Thank you. I know the purple hoodie. This this suits you. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's more masculine. Yes, it's more masculine. <laughs> but you could also define it as a, an alpha woman. True. A woman true, that likes to make a statement. Mm. You see? So the type of fragrance, if you wear it as a woman, they will ask you, what are you wearing? Sure yeah. Yeah. It's smelling, yeah, for that. So basically, oh, it's a fragrance nice. that dominates. Yeah, it settles into it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, this is my favorite, though. Yeah. You can wear it if you have anything on today. Do I have anything on today? Um, I do, but I don't mind. I'm a spring, please. Thank you. The one that I just had. Yeah. Smell like honey. What do we have here? It's chicken, tomato, uh, and lemon. Oh, okay. I'm gonna have the chicken. This is chicken. Thank you. Thank you so much. Hey boos. I'm actually back from the event. I'm trying to settle into driving because I don't know about you, but I don't drive in heels. So I've got like these Puma slops I wear. So I'm just going to take this off and then I'm going to drive. But Begum Nandias, guys, um, very intimate. 
also it's a crowd I'm not familiar with, but begum nandi regardless. Like it was very very nice. Um, shushing a hamba because like I said, I'm not So I left um an hour after I was there, but I did capture some amazing footage and it was such a nice event. Um, I'm talking to myself and there's a car guard here looking at me. I'm not talking to myself, I'm talking to the camera. But, you know, Anyways, yeah, it was very, very nice. Very cool, very intimate. Um, definitely enjoyed it. They have like this collaboration that they are doing, Idio, with some Japanese artist so it has like this floral notes and scents around the Dior house or Dior company so the whole event was also launching that um, and some of the fragrances that are being launched along from that line so yeah very very nice guys um, it started at 10 which is quite early but it ended also quite early which is at 12 so now I'm on my way home I don't know if I told you guys that when for Mother's Day my siblings and I went to our mom's grave and I wasn't driving my brother was driving us so I left my car keys in this car and I'm currently using my spare key but now I don't have house keys to go into the house and I know my partner Gimtina said you mean Anyways, I'm trying to figure out his robot so I can get into the house and do a proper unboxing for you guys and see which fragrance I probably got because I also don't know. It was like a blind, you know, I wouldn't say, well, yeah, we just chose fragrances blindly. So I don't know which one I got and I'm so excited to see which one is in the box. Anyways, I'm driving home now, guys. I'm hungry. <laughs> yes, there was food. But it was just like finger sex. So I need some real food. Okay, so we are back online. I just actually wanted to use my mic, guys. I don't think I mentioned that, or maybe I did, but I bought a mic and I've been trying to like amplify my sound. So I hope this works. Anyways, without further ado, excuse the mess on my desk if you see it. I just came back from the event and I wanted to do my Christian's yours your unboxing with you guys. So um, like I mentioned in the car that we actually got to experience the the store and test out fragrances, but when it came to our goodie bag, our fragrances were already packaged, so we basically did a blind um choosing of the fragrances so i'm gonna unbox mine right over here so this is the collab packaging with the um, with the artist they're collaborating with i forgot i honestly forgot so it has the christian dior hot stamp there in black and then I'm gonna try open it. This is actually my first Dior fragrance, so it's a first for both of us. I don't even know how to open it. Oh, there we go. And inside, when you open it, it looks like that. Hmm. I hope I'm trying to peep, or oh, at the same time showing you guys. So we have the. Christian Dior dust bag, I guess. There's a envelope inside here that has nothing. <laughs> this envelope has nothing. And then this is what she looks like inside. And then The grand reveal. <gasps> I actually really like this one. I got a full size Gris Dior. There we go. 
and some samples. <gasps> I'm so happy I got this one because I like this one in store. <gasps> and we got some samples in here. The Amber Noir Toba Color, I guess. Focus. Is it focusing? There we go. I got these. And then I have vanilla something. I don't know how to say these names. Also, why is it not focusing? I say I'm not doing a full focus. Anyways, you catch the drift. And yeah, so that's, and then I have like this pillow. How cute. <laughs> so yeah, this is a very nice gesture. Thank you to Dior for having me. I'm very lucky. I'm a very lucky girl right now. And I'm very happy. So yeah. I'm excited. I'm going to open this on my Instagram, but obviously YouTube got the first peek. So I'm going to do like an Instagram unboxing and then thank them on my stories for inviting me so they can continue inviting me to pay them. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much, Dior Gateway. Um, the Dior boutique store is at gateway if you didn't know the gateway mall so if you want to go check it out or just even like visits you don't have to buy stuff sometimes so you can just find your scent um it's just so nice to go the store is beautiful it is stunning it's situated across lacoste and next to the h&m side of gateway which is like on the ground floor so if you're interested you can go check it out and yeah that's it for me today. I guess I will see you later or like tomorrow. But yeah, I had a really good day. Oh, guys, I added a little faux plant there from Pep Home. I have a little bit of updates everywhere, but I'm going to share that when the time is right. But yeah, let me clean up my little makeup space and I'll see you guys in the next clip. Hey, guys, I come back. It is later on in the evening and I'm actually on my way to the second event of the night which I almost forgot about so I just changed my outfit and are you guys interested in outfit videos because I don't know sometimes I want to show myself sometimes I don't. I don't know if you guys appreciate that or not but yeah I changed into an outfit and I will show you guys at the venue. I'm actually going to screen, which is a first, and I don't know how to dress for a screening, so I just put stuff together that I feel comfortable in, basically. So yeah, I'll see you guys at the venue. Okay guys, so this is outfit of the night. This puffer jacket is from Shein. This mesh top is from Cotton On. Um, <laughs> these pants are also from Shein and I'm wearing my Air Force One heels. These heels I wear with everything because they go with everything. Guys, my daughter's in the frame because she doesn't want me to flourish. But this is what it looks like and my bag is from Zara. Um, these, this is from my latest order. The jacket and the pants are from my latest order. Please bully me into recording a haul for you guys because i'm sure you will love the pieces i love them so much and then yeah that's it i am off to my event you have to say something to me then I where are we why are you walking why are you looking cute on so, a tuesday looking cute on a tuesday because i'm at a hang off for the screening of two sides what is two sides a documentary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there I, I it felt is. the same way when I saw the invite. <laughs> wow. <laughs>
it Cause the world told me we ain't got that common sense Gotta prove it to myself that I'm on top of shit And you would never know a guy without the goddess Is honest and fucking honest kid And I could be on everything I mean I could be the leader, head of all the states I could smile and jiggle it, tell us I can send it I could be the CEO just like a Robin Fenty And I'ma be there for you cause you want my team, girl Don't ever think you ain't hell of these niggas dream, girl They wanna pit us against each other when we succeed And for no reasons they wanna see it Hey guys I am back home unfortunately I did leave my camera in the car so the footage that you're gonna get from the day's TV events is actually off my phone so I hope you guys don't mind the quality but before I wash my makeup off and I call it a night because it's been one of those busy days for me I just want to unbox my Goodie bag from DSTV. So that's what it looks like. Um, and the documentary is based on the Springbok and Lions matches, basically. <laughs> and it's airing on DSTV on Sunday, the 15th of May, premiering at 6. Um, on Mnet channel 101 and on Super Sport it's going to premiere at 7pm on channel 201 so please look out for that I mean to be quite honest it's, it's not my crowd but it was a very interesting documentary to watch especially because it took place um, during a very difficult time in our country which was the civil unrest with the looting and everything that happened last year. So the documentary also covers that um, as well as the sport in general. And you know, it was, it was a really interesting and inspiring episode. So inside, guys, this box is for you. Corner E. Oh, it looks like a duffel bag. Okay. Hey. Okay, it's a duffel bag. <laughs> okay. And then, oh, we got Sia Khaleesi's book called Rise. That's interesting, guys. And then, I got. This is why the box is heavy. <laughs> a decanter set. How cool. It was like a whiskey. See, decanting. Wow. Thank you, DSTV. This is really thoughtful. Especially this. I'm, I'm very interested to read upon Rise. And then, well, that's it for today, guys. This was a full working day. I really tried my best to take you guys along, but I need to catch some Z's. Proper, proper Z's. And yeah, call it a night. I'm, if we've reached the end of this vlog, thank you so, so much for watching. I really, really hope you enjoy spending these chaotic <laughs> days with me. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do click the red subscribe button. Don't forget to press the thumbs up like button if you like this video. And please share your comments down below because I love interacting with you guys. I truly do. So until next time, I'm signing off. Calling it a night. And I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye.